like so. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. What's going on, family? <laughs> yes, Hello. that's Hi. right. Welcome back to the Welcome Unfiltered back. Exchange podcast. Yes, Chloe and Frankie in the house. <laughs> hey. Hello, we're back. Back, back, back. Yes. Um, yeah, today you can probably tell we're both in pajamas. <laughs> so um, we're coming to you all today mm-hmm. um, with a new segment that we'd like to call the Pajama Party Chats. Yes. That's why um, we're in our pajamas today, right? Yeah. yeah, oh, well, yeah. Well, this is so not like what? planned, but we're both in purple. We actually are. What? I actually didn't even know that. I, I didn't realise until... Realized. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> anyway, well, that's funny. Yeah, oh, well, well um, it's good. You know, Rick, look... Is, <laughs> yes? Rick. This is Rick, yeah. I've Rick. never seen Rick and Morty. Yeah. So yes. I don't know who... who this is who. Rick. If I'm wrong, Karina's going to crucify me for this. My but, sister's yes. obsessed. <laughs> this is Rick. I'm... Uh, this is definitely Rick. It yes, is. yes, Are it's you Rick. Sure? Yes, hundred percent. Rick from Rick and Morty. Rick oh, and Morty. Good. Rick and Morty. I know Rick. that song. Rick, yeah. So you're Soldier in Boy. Rick, and I'm in. I'm in Yasmin. She's got her brat thing going on with my brats. Yes. I love the brats. Yes, but let's jump straight into weekly recap. Let the people know what's going on. How our oh week's my goodness, been? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, I don't know what's happened this week. Has it been full on for you? It's been full on. I've had lots of doctor's appointments and yeah, busy at work. Busy at work. Um, yeah. You know also, what? My week has been f- so busy, but like I feel like nothing. I don't know. Nothing. Have you gotten some time off though? You reckon? Yeah, you don't well, think so? It's, it's Easter now. So. Yeah, long weekend. Yeah. Long weekend. Um, I took actually I took work off on Thursday, so I had Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, five days off. That's great. That's. Oh, that's freaking amazing. That's really good. That's really good, yeah. Then there's me. I left work on Thursday early. I wasn't feeling well. Yeah. So I left work early and went to bed. Um, yes. And then yeah. My... Also, wait, 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 just quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are filming a couple of these in advance. Yes. Just a little PSA, which I'm sure some people have realised. Yeah. Um, just because given the timing, like it's Easter, it's hustle, it's bustle, it's... Yeah. So, like... It's been a very busy past couple yeah. of weeks, so we still obviously want to deliver. Yeah, but at the so, same time in saying that, we're de- it's going to get to a point where it's going to be it's, weekly. I reckon yeah. after this episode... It'll be... It will be. After this yeah, episode, ep- yeah. it's going to be yeah. live. Yeah. Not live, but, but in I don't, real time. I don't think people are really fussed that much, if I'm being honest. No, definitely not, but no, just a little um, PSA. But yeah. it's just good for you guys to, to know that. So whatever yeah. you're thinking, you're right. Yeah, you know, <laughs> you are correct. You're, you're, you're not tripping out. Bit, Your sanity is yeah, all good. You're yeah. not tripping out. Yeah. Also, did you realize at the start I couldn't get my words out? <laughs> Mumble jumble. No, nothing was coming out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was about. <laughs> it was a matter of time. Sorry. It was a matter of time. Yes, it Just, was, it a, was matter a matter of time. Of time yes, yes, for him to drop Do his. Yes, his air yes. horn. Um, but yeah, this week's just been really hectic, so yeah. hence why we are recording in advance. Yes, but, but we're it's pretty chilled now because yeah, we're now, in our pajamas. It's really nice. Chilling. It's it's, pa- it's pajama party chats. That's what so it is. Ev- I just knocked the table. Eventually, as we get people to come in, yeah, you know, we could have someone come in and do a pajama party chats with us. Hundred percent. Um, dress. You know, get, get your best yeah, pajamas just, in. Just we're meeting. Come, we're, we're chilling. We're yeah, hanging out. You know. That's it. My, Just meaning that we're comfy and we're chatting. Yeah. And just yeah. so you know that we're in our pajamas. We're Watch. comfy and talking shit. Yes. Pretty much. <laughs> Literally. Yes. yes. Comfy and talking shit. Yes. And maybe while you guys are watching, you can be in your pajamas too. Yes, hundred percent. There's nothing better than watching or listening to a podcast. Yeah. But I think it's in just, your PJs. It's good. It's good chilled vibes as well. Um, you know, people want to relax. Yes. You can't always be in an outfit looking yeah. nice. Well, I we're mean, comfy anyway. Yeah, we're comfy and we look we're looking nice as well. So that's. Yeah. That's win-win situation. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, but um, um, but yeah, our weekly recaps not really. Well, my little sister turned eleven. Yes. Happy yes. birthday, Tati Nana. Tati Nana. Nah, her name's Tatiana, Tatiana, but we call her Tati Nana. She's cute. Yes. Shout out to Tati Nana. Um, yeah, it was her birthday. We went over to the family's home. My mom cooked up. No, actually, my sister cooked up oh. something. Big sis cooked up some African food. Yum. You know, we had jollof rice. Yes. Um, fried plantain, plantain on the side. 
And we had you, well, you had the chicken. Oh, it was good. Lots of chicken. It was good. It was tantalizing. And we had B day, B day. Oh my god, B day cake, birthday cake, B day cake. <laughs> That's so fucking stupid. B day cake. B day cake. Would you like some B day cake? That's terrible. <laughs> birthday cake. Yeah, and then there was singing, happy birthday. Oh my god. <laughs> happy birthday. No, to... it's boy. They happy birthday. The way that they were saying yeah. that your mum and sister were singing. I was dying. We were saying getting. They the, were putting um, on the accent. A broken um, yeah. in, a broken accent. Where day? Yeah, our librarian broke oh, in um, my English. God. And Chloe was just pissing herself laughing. I've been saying it all day. I've yeah. been walking around the oh. house. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> and then I remember when you heard it, and then we started clapping Everyone and singing. Started clapping. I'm like, oh it was like God. we're back in church. This just- is great. <laughs> it was so funny because yeah. they literally put this boy, and I was boy. Yeah, yeah. I was trying not to laugh, but I couldn't help myself. I didn't even Everyone know that was, was gonna laughing. happen. I honestly didn't know that was gonna happen. It caught me off guard Sing as well. It. So give, I just, give us an happy example. Happy boy, do you? Happy boy, do you? <laughs> <laughs> literally, it was so good. So good. Yeah, and you're but in you the background what? jamming as well. But with uh, it, yeah. you know what I like? You guys have a second verse. And yeah. You sing How Old Are You Now? Yeah. How old are you now? How old are you now? One thing one thing with Africans is that we turn everything into I, a it's beat. The best. I love into it. a beat, into dancing. Like it's mm. all about beat and rhythm. So yeah, even birthday songs, you know? Yeah. Well yeah. the Italians we just go Tantiaguriate and it's very slow. No, no, no. You guys go like this. <laughs> What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Oh, I've been wanting to See use that one. See this man with his buttons? Oh my god! How did Italian? That's, you literally named it Italian. That's amore. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. Um. Yeah. <laughs> You oh, still can't get um, over it. That was the most random thing I think that's happened on this yeah. podcast. I, lo- I love that. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's... I still like this one. Which oh. one's that? This one. Bomboka. Ah, Bombokla. I like that one. Bombokla. Yes, yes. Ooh, well, we're going international. <laughs> We've gone from Italian to... Wait, mm. we went from Liberian to Italian to, to Jamaican. Jamaican. Ah, look at that. We're Mr. and Mrs. Worldwide. You little shit. Yeah. I okay. like that one too. You like that one? You Frankie little updates the buttons. Frankie updates them. Sometimes Weekly. I give him some input as well. Yeah. Um... And we just have a new button, new couple of buttons yeah. every episode. If you I'm haven't, just, if you haven't realized, yeah. I'm just having a fun, um, fun with this roadcaster <laughs> thing. It's, yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. If you ever get the chance to get one, get one and just yeah, have fun with it. But obviously, purposeful fun as well. Oh my god! What? Can you hear the rain? Is it raining outside? It's pouring. It's raining. It is. I don't pouring. know if you guys can hear it. It's pouring. Yeah. Yeah. There may be a thunder. There was thunder before. Yeah. But I think the weather in Melbourne today has been shit. You know what we had? It's good, been shit. Good weather the whole weekend. Yeah, it's been great all week, and now it's just gone to shit. Yeah. I just, I just don't want tomorrow Typical. to be the same because we're going back to work. I, I hate going to work when it's raining. Yeah. I, Especially if I have open toe shoes, and my toes get wet while I'm walking. You got the Jesus sandals? No, my heels. The Gargamel three thousands? Oh my god. No. I don't wear Jesus shoes. Oh my god, it's getting heavier. <laughs> Don't worry about the rain. We'll just block out the noise and yeah. keep going. Anyway, that's yeah. Melbourne. That's but that's tech for you. The you know all the tech and stuff we've got. We'll be able to bo- black up. Uh, we'll be able to block out the noise. So don't worry about yeah, no, that. That's fine. Yeah. All yeah. good. Um, yeah. But yeah, um, we'll introduce our topic for today. Yes. Um. So it's pajama party chats. Yes. Today we're talking about childhood. Um. I do believe we're gonna have a few episodes based on yeah. childhood. Yeah. We um, might. We might do a back to back. Back to back or just yeah. sporadically. Yeah. But um childhood. Yeah. Today we're just gonna be sharing some stories. Yeah. Um we've got a QA from our social media. Yes. Um that we wanna, you know, share talk with to you guys, guys as well and give yeah. it give it a little bit of dialogue as well along the way with that. Yeah. 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 Um yeah. just some some interesting things that happened to us when we mm-hmm. were kids. Just, you know, you guys know how it is. It's all unfiltered. We just talk shit and you yeah. guys listen and you guys, you know, you know, you can talk to us as well. Yeah. Um, and share your stories share as well. Share your stories. 
Um, but yeah, so today we're going to be talking about childhood. Frankie, do you want to take it away? Yes, I'll take it away. Okay, so you go first. Majority of my childhood, right? Um, when it, it wasn't in Africa, I spent I spent a small portion of it in Africa, right? Yes. So, um, the ones I remember was actually here in Australia. So, oh. I, yeah. how old were you when you came here? I was, I think, seven or eight. Okay, so I always forget. Yeah, yeah, oh, uh, sorry. yeah. I was, uh, I could be wrong with the age, yeah. but I just need to like go roughly. back. Yes, roughly seven or eight. Yeah. So um, I rem- I remember actually the first time um, I met, like I had these group of kids when I, we moved to Thomastown, I had these group of kids. Mm-hmm. They used to play soccer with us. Oh, so cute. I actually, I used to go play soccer with them. Yeah. They, they saw that I was an import. I was new to the country. They're like, oh, you know, this, look at this fresh African booty scratcher. Let's. What's a booty scratcher? It's just a. It's just a phrase. Is it racist? Because I just said it. No, it's not. Okay. There's actually a TV show after. A, um, there's a TV show called African Booty Scratcher. Uh, it's as a long as I don't segment. get done for. No, 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 no. It's a bit like everybody hates Chris. Th- this, oh, but anyways. Okay. We we should probably watch it one day. But um, getting back to the story. Um, I used to play soccer with these kids. Mm. I think they were they were Macedonian kids, right? Yeah. And they were really nice and they were really welcoming, right? Mm. But at the same time, I was a. Uh, Yes, I was a little shit as a kid, right? And <laughs> every time my mom told me, hey, you got to wait or you can't have something, mm-hmm. I didn't really want to take no for an answer. So I'd go out of my way and be innovative to find a way to get what I wanted. So one day I remembered this story till this day because it's taught me a massive lesson in life that I use till this day. Mm-hmm. Um, it shaped me big time. One day... I don't know what the fuck got in my head. I just decided, hey, this kid, I saw him. He had, do you know the game gaming system PSP? Yes. Yeah, so I never had one, but I saw people with one. Yeah. Is that the console? Yeah, it's the console. You, you could bring it anywhere. It's like wireless. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so it was portable. You could take it anywhere, play video games and things on it, right? <laughs> you all right? Yeah. I've got drink, hiccups. Drink agua. <laughs> drink agua. <laughs> Sorry. <Continue. laughs> she got the hickey, hickey cup. cup. Um, <laughs> to the cup, to the hickey, to the cup. Um, yeah, so I saw him playing with it. I was like, oh, shit, that's cool. I want this, you know. I want this. And mm. if your boy wants this, he's going to find a way to get this. So, obviously. Oh, my God. I already know where this is yes, going. Me being the Frankie. You little shit that yeah, you are. the Frankie that you are. Yes, what well, that I was back then. Mm. I waited for an opportunity one day. I saw these kids, um door open and I went into his home, right? You walked into someone's house. Yes. Yeah. You have balls, man. Of steel. Nah, nah. Oh, my God. Look. look. <laughs> you walked into someone's yeah, home. Yep, I did. And I'm not... Look, now that I tell the story, I'm not proud of it. But at the same time, I was a kid. Like, I didn't know any better, right? But um, wow. I went into his home. I found it. But um, I wasn't smart either. I wasn't a smart thief because obviously somebody saw me going in, right? I'm like the only black kid in the neighborhood. Like, you know what I mean? Like people are going to know. So I go home, I run, I go home, like thinking I'm more safe and everything in the, in the clear, but I was having heart palpitations. I'm I'm engaged to a robber. Yes. I'm robber. Armed. I was a child robber, not a, not an adult robber. Yes. Yes. I'm explaining this story because, you know, there's a lesson that came from it. Yes. pretty much made me who I am today. Yes. So I go home having heart palpitations. Um, I found it like a, a spot in the in my room. I hit it, right, thinking that I was smart. But you not, hit it? Yeah, I what hit it. What was the spot? Do you it remember? Was, it was like a those um, refugee bags. Like the, the, oh, the, the, the big, yeah. we call them the wog bags. Yes, the those bl- bags. They're blue, red, and they're like yes. plastic. Yes, yeah, that, the wog, that, the wog that's bags, exactly yeah. what I hit it in, right? Refugee bags. We call them refugee bags because on like a lot oh. of the time you they're like travelers' bags. A lot of travelers had them okay. back in those days. Yeah. Uh, back, you know, when I was growing up. Yeah. So oh my God, I hit it, go. and they came. Obviously, came to the house accusing me, and I was like, "Oh no, 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 no! I didn't do it." Blah blah blah. You know, and my mom's like, "Okay." I know it is good for you, this boy. Yeah? African mums and just African parents in general don't they don't play. They don't play. So my mum's like, I right, I got some for you, boy. She goes in that in, in the room, searches everything, and she finds it. <laughs> she, your life is over. She your finds life is over. <laughs> oh, if I tell you I was sweating. <laughs> If I tell you the sweat that I was, I was sweating bullets because I, I knew, just imagine. Oh man, I was gone. 
I was done. I was done for. She found it. Oh, she shit. gave it back to the kid. She obviously apologized to him and his parents because. Oh my God, your not, poor mother. She was probably so embarrassed of yes, you. Yes, because that's not how she raised me. You know, no. she tried to raise me to be a good boy, right? Child after, of God. Yes. After that kid left, I'll cop the ass whooping of my life. That was some juicy ass whooping. In the moment in time, hey, it is it is what it is, right? You do the crime, you do the ass whooping, not the time, yeah? So I got my ass whooped. Now, the whole point of that story was yeah. obviously those kids, they never saw me the same again. Yeah. They're like, oh, you know. He stole my shit. Why yeah. did you want? Yeah, I would have. I wouldn't be your friend after that. Yeah, yeah. And the crazy thing was, we went to the same primary school as well. Oh shit! Yeah, were you in the same class? No, that would have been I, very I think awkward. We actually was in the same class, but we weren't. Like, I'm not really sure about 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 that. But um, yeah. So after that day, you know, I learnt my lesson. Frankie, that's bad. I you've never told me this. You've never heard this? No. Really? Well, I don't feel safe with you now. <laughs> Hey, too late, man. <laughs> Seven years later. You, yeah, well, nah. you, know, you know what? None of my shit's gone missing. So Yeah, well, yeah. There's only us two. So if shit goes missing, it's either between the both of us. Frankie, well, that's now bad. that I'm telling this story, right? Yeah. Just, <laughs> I'm, nah. I'm like, I'm suspect number one. You yes. are very suspicious, this you're boy. You're going to be the first. Yeah. You know what, though? Like, when you're a kid, you do stupid yeah. shit. Yeah. That was my stupid shit moment. You do stupid shit. And I'm like, of of course, I don't condone parents hitting their kids, right? But each uh, each each if, their if own. If they need it, they need it. Mate. L- listen, each Sorry. their own. The times are different now <laughs> and everything. But back then, the way I was brought up, that's just how. No, of course, I've got, I got hit as a kid. Yeah, that's just how it's the, given, the mate, playing field you're a, is. You're a wog, you get hit. Yeah, but I but I understood I'll it. I'm the cooler, mate. <laughs> 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 Yes, represent. With the spoon, mate. Italia represent, Maltese represent, eh? Mm. Yes. So, till this day, right, that was the only thing I've ever stolen in my life. I kid you not, if I'm walking down oh God, the aisle, because you know I wear cargo pants as well, right? Yeah. And my cargo pants have got a lot of pockets. If I ever, like, just to even, like, shoplift, I just see. Your mouth just dropped. Yeah, like <laughs> no, like I'm getting I'm getting PTSD right now, like just to even shoplift, God. like you can't that, shoplift, mate. Nah, like I can't even like it's been ingrained within me that ass whooping did oh its my job. God. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. So yeah, that's oh, pretty much one Frankie. of my um, childhood memories. That's really and, bad. Yes. Look, I can't relate. I've never stolen anything, yeah. and I can assure you, if I had stolen anything. Yeah. My fingers on my hands would have been cut off. You, you probably you'd be fingerless right now. I would have, missing, I'd missing have hands. No, I, I would have no fingers. No my spirit parents, fingers. My parents would be beside themselves. Spirit fingers. Um, hello, mum and dad. I've yes. never stolen. Yes. They know that. Um, when, point, point the finger at me right here. This one. I'm trying to think of something that happened to me. Well, I, I can tell you now that when um regarding like a game, yeah. a gaming toy thing. Yeah. I had a pink DS. Yes. And one day, well, my parents got a new car. My mum got a Typhoon, I think, XR6. I don't know. It was, yeah. like, done up. Like, this thing flew. Yeah. And it was, like, new. And I was so addicted to this game on my DS that yeah. I had to go to the toilet and I didn't go. Oh, I didn't get out of the car to pee. And, mind you, we're in a brand new car. No. And I pissed all over the seats. Boom, bucket. Yeah. That is what you are, my friend. And I peed everywhere. Yes. Because yes. I was so addicted to my DS game. The DS was more important than your. Yep. Mm. Look, uh, yeah. What what game were you playing? Do you remember? Probably Cooking Mama. That was my game. Cooking Mama. Cooking Mama. I love. Cooking Mama. That was my shit. Or or, um, there was one where you like had a baby, a baby born. No, that's the toy. No, no, no. There was one, the pet one. Remember the pet one? Yeah, I used to um. Pet sitting or something like that. Yeah, I used to have that, and then the the one where you had a horse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. I never had a DS, but. I used to see the cover of the, the yeah. video games and people used to play it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We yeah. had we had some Dodge Man. Yeah. And he used to, he gave us a Oh, chip. the Dodgy Man. We had the chip. Yeah. And the one chip had thousands yeah. of games. Oh, that's that's the best. That is the best. If yeah. you if 
you're from Melbourne, you know the the illegal back back store oh, at Preston yeah. Market or something. They don't have, they don't have that now anymore. No. The all the burned all CDs the, and the things. CDs out the yeah, the that shit was good. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that shit was good. I have a, I have a story. <laughs> I have a story with what? that. What? So one night, me and my mum and my sister were home. Yeah. And this is when we were living. I was living with my fam. Yeah. And this guy. They, he was just driving through and he got arrested at the front of my house. Oh, wow. Yeah, random. Like a raid, like just no, 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 a bus, no, no. a random bus. I think bus. he got pulled over or yeah. something. Got arrested. They arrested him on the road. Yeah. They were at the front for ages and then they've driven off. Yeah. And the guy has thrown his wallet and everything under the car. Yeah. So they didn't oh, see it. Oh, so he was trying to like. Yeah, so they, like, they cleaned up everything. They yeah, everyone yeah. left. Yeah. They've all left. Police are gone. And I'm like, Mum, there's a wallet on the road and it belongs to the guy. Yeah, yeah. So the... I've picked it up and I've taken it inside. And we... <laughs> you just incriminated, like, that's well, like we a crime the, scene. No, no, kind we of rang thing. the police. Yeah, 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 we yeah, rang yeah. them back and said, hey, there was a crime scene at the front of our house. Someone, a crime yeah. scene. Someone got arrested. Yeah. And they can't, they're going to come back to pick it up. Yeah. And we had. A box, I shit you not, bigger than a shoebox, probably two shoeboxes of like of burnt CDs Woo! on the floor in our living area. Mm. So the cops have come. Mm, mm, mm. The cops came to pick up this wallet, and the box was on the floor. <gasps> Talk about coincidences <laughs> and chances, and man. And you know what? They Are you didn't for real. See. I'm being serious. You ask my mum. Did they just look? Did they look the other way? I don't even think they saw it. They closed. We closed the door. Finished off with the police, and I'm like, mum. <laughs> Mom, the bad CDs on the floor. <laughs> but you know what? If, if they wanted to do something to us, they they, they, they could have done it. Yeah, bad. But they didn't. Bad. Yeah. You guys are lucky. I know. So much has gone down in you, my area. That was lucky. Yeah. Yeah. That but, was a situation. It was so funny because it was yeah. like such good weather. Yeah. And if fucking police said hey, hey, arrest those those people those burn CD people they were doing good justice man you like, know what we watched movies that hadn't even yeah. come out yet they like, they were doing poetic uh, you know social I justice I reckon you know what I had what the Shark Tale you know Shark Tale yeah yeah yeah, yeah we yeah. had that burnt on a disc right when it came out before it came oh. out. But in the, Oscar. in the middle of the movie, you just see all these people walking <laughs> they walk across the- on the screen, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they record it. They're they recording they- it in the cinema. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's funny. Oh, my God. So when we're watching Shark Tale, a movie when they're literally under the water in the ocean. Under the sea. And you just see these people walking. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's me. crazy. That's funny. <clears throat> you okay? I got the air conditioner cough again. It's back again. Mm, yeah. We probably shouldn't turn the air conditioner on before in uh, a recording. Yeah, I know. Yeah. But, yeah, that's um, oh, that's wow. the DVDs. Oh, what else happened? You know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to say a big shout out to those guys for doing what they did because that made our childhood. Like, going oh, yeah. to the movies back then was expensive. Yes. Before the whole streaming <gasps> ch- like, <gasps> let's. I have a story when yeah, you're done. Yeah, well, but I want to give them an air horn. <laughs> I know you guys made some somebody out there childhood. They used to go and, and they purchase made our those things. Tri- yeah. Both of us. Both of us, Me but definitely sister, other people out there can relate. Yeah. 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 Oh my god, hundred percent. Yeah, big time. Even like if you go into like Laverton Market, they'd have yeah. everything there. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. yeah. They no. used to sell dogs there, I'm pretty sure. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, no, nah, that's like puppies. They okay. have like puppy. I don't know what <laughs> Okay, okay. Trash and treasure on Laverton Market. <laughs> yeah, 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 they used yeah. to sell everything, all yeah. the DVDs, CDs, everything. Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, that's good. Sorry. Back on movies. Yeah, yeah, you were going to so say. So when I was yeah. a kid, my mum took me and my cousin Alicia to see um, Material Girls. Yeah, it's a I, movie. I've not seen it, but yeah. It sounds And Karina wasn't invited. She was Ooh, too little. She would have cracked it. So we told her to go to the toilet or my mum go to the toilet. Yeah. And then we left. <gasps> with like, because Car- your mum would have said, hey, Karina, go with them, yeah? Yeah. Oh, you did that. So we did that. Oh, um, no. And a result of that was we get to the movies <laughs> and you know how they have the ads? Yeah, yeah. They have the ads for, yeah, yeah. Um, like, upcoming movies. Yeah, before you, so I'm gonna before get the this, movie starts. I'm going to get this collectible. This yeah. is um, Victor and Emily from Corpse Bride, right? Yeah. This is now my favourite movie. Yeah. But. This was just coming out when yeah. Material Girls was at the cinema. Yeah, yeah. And the it's a Tim Burton movie. Yeah. So, like, it's very dark. Everyone he's, kind of knows yeah. his aesthetic when it comes to yeah, movies, for, right? Yeah, he's like a dark, dark theme. Yeah. So this is apparently a kid's movie, Corpse Bride, and the 
the ad for it freaked me the fuck out. Like yeah. I, yeah, I couldn't sleep after for weeks. after seeing that. I was sleeping, and now with you've my got mom. a collectible. For, oh, I, I was it's like scared. one of your favorite movies. So that's my story now. It's yeah. literally my favorite movie. Like yeah. I actually want a tattoo of these two. Okay. Um. So it wasn't the fact that you guys went to see Material Girl. It was the fact that you snuck. It was the fact that. You snuck it away from Karina and then you ended up liking Corpse Bride and it became and your thing. And now it's my favourite movie of yeah. all time. Yeah. Like, it's up there. Ah, oh, that's that, good. That and Scarface. That's really good. Oh, I got one. Can I share another Go one? Go for it. Yeah. We're talking, so, man. That's what we're yeah, here that's for. What we're, oh, my God. I just moved the whole table. It's not the first time you did that. Sorry. Nah, all good. All good. <laughs> it's all fun. It's all vibes. All good. Um, so... Oh, yes, I remember my... So we go to this thing, a bit of context. Growing up in an African home, especially West Africans, they're very religious, very big on Christianity. Um, so we go to a lot of church, um, a lot of prayer groups, night during the day, usually happening at other people's homes, right? Mm-hmm. So I remember this one time when I was young, my mum my used to go there a lot. Yeah. Yes, yeah, at, this, at this family's... Um, place so someone's someone's yeah. place pretty much that was close to ours so she asked me hey do you want to come i was like oh nah nah like you know i don't want to come i want to go to bed and sleep right mm-hmm. so she leaves now i had a bm a little bmx bike at the time mm-hmm. and oh that's yeah. cute so at the time it was my uncle my sister and i yeah. and my mum were all just like living in the same house mind you this is the house my mum found the psb in as well so oh my God. <laughs> this house has got a lot of history got lots of stories. <laughs> yeah yeah um and then i go to bed and well supposedly i was supposed to be in bed and i all of a sudden something just hit me i was like oh i miss my mama like because I was like a mama's boy when I was younger, yeah. right? I miss my mama. And then my uncle had the responsibility of making sure that everything was good. Like, because yeah. he's the, the, the parental guardian in the home now yeah. that my mom's gone to this thing. So I don't w- know what came over me, right? But I guess it's me being you a. Little shit. Again. Oh my God. <laughs> I got on my BMX bike. It was like eight o'clock at night, pitch black. How old were you? Oh, I probably was like. 10 at the oh time. Oh, my God. I, I didn't... I, I clearly didn't learn my lesson. I was a little shit, man. Like, I was a little shit. Bad. So, I get my BMX bike, right? I get onto it and I just start riding. Because I know... I've been to the home before and I know how far it is. Like, yeah. So, it was probably like a two kilometers ride. No, it's not far, but still you're Not 10. far. You're a little but, kid. But then it would cause a whole panic because my uncle wakes up in the night. He goes into my room looking for me. Like, <laughs> where's Frankie? Everyone, my sister wakes up. Where's Frankie? Oh my god! Like everyone's flipping their Being shit. Abducted. Yeah, they probably thought somebody put me in a plastic bag or something and just and took me right and just I got put kidnapped. Put me in a plastic bag. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was a thing in Ghana. They, they used to do it to kids in Ghana. Just, just yeah. Oh, okay, so it was it's a thing. thing. So, okay, cool. Yeah. Yep. No, not cool, but yeah. Yeah. Okay, so got you. they were they were obviously panicking because nobody know what happened. Where am I? I could have been kidnapped. Is so, this in Australia? This is in, this Australia. Is in Australia. Mind you, this is in Australia, right? Yeah. So I go, my mom, they open the door, they're like, oh, it's Frankie. Everyone's like, what the, like, what is why doing that? Why here? Are like, you here? Why are you here at the time? So my mom didn't make much of it. Um, I came in, I was like cuddled up next to her. They're like singing and praying and worshipping. And I'm just there like, oh, happy, smiling, <laughs> you know? And my uncle's fucking freaking out, like, <laughs> thinking like, oh my God, where's this kid? So he calls my mom and my mom's like, yeah, everything's fine. Like, why are you freaking out? They're like, Frankie left that. Like, we don't you know what Frankie... You didn't tell anyone. No, I just left. But so, did you leave through a back door? I left through the front door, but I was a little shit again. Like, I snuck out. Oh, my God. So I didn't make, like, I snuck out. I didn't make it, like, a whole uproar, like, you know, yeah. let it be known. Because obviously I wouldn't have been allowed to go. They would have told me, hey, no, wait for your mum to come home and then mm. you can go. So I snuck out. And then you're such a shit. I am a, such a shit. Now you know that I look why? Back it's because it. you're the second child. You reckon there's a second child syndrome? Um, yes. Big time. You reckon? I have, I believe in second child syndrome <laughs> because it's like the second child yeah. is always more cheekier. Yeah, yeah. Well, I was very cheeky. Not like the first child's perfect, but like there's always that cheeky little. Inkling. Well, you 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 need it, right? Yeah. Um, there's always somebody that's yeah. That's definitely, yeah. maybe it is a thing. I don't know, right? But I was definitely cheeky as oh a kid. Oh, my God, Frankie. So 
my like my mum was like, oh, like nah, nah, he's with me, he's all good. But my uncle, man, like I think he was like he, you know why mm. he would have been liable for you disappearing. Yeah, big That's time, <laughs> big time. But I think when he heard my mum say, yeah, he's with me, he's fine. It yeah. was like a <sighs> okay, yeah. And then did you get bashed? No, I didn't oh. get I didn't get in trouble for this one. <laughs> Because I didn't get they let this one slide, you know. Good. But um, yeah, yeah, that's some of my story God, time. Frankie. I've look, I've got a lot of I stories. I didn't know you, but... that you were this like much of a little shit. Yeah, well, that's why I'm sharing it with you and the people. You little shit. <laughs> you little shit. <laughs> one more for good luck. You little shit. Yeah, I deserve that. <clears throat> I deserve that. <laughs> my God, man, that's bad. Yeah, yeah. I'm a bad boy. I can't believe that. Bad boys, bad boys. You don't come across as that type of person. No, because because I had a I had a moment awakening. Well, you matured. Your yes. frontal lobe. Yes, I matured. And you know you want to know frontal what frontal lobe developed. You you know what my awakening moment was? What? Was in high school in year eight when I almost got bashed for saying something to an islander girl that I shouldn't have said. Frankie. And she had her cousins and they almost oh my God. they almost beat the crap out of me and I would have rightly yeah, deserved I'm, I'm it. Right, good. Yeah. But that was oh my, my that was my moment like it flicked the switch. I was like, yeah, nah, I gotta get my shit together. Yeah. Or, well, yeah. you know what? You have little sisters. You should be having Yeah, well. I'm not the same person anymore. I but know, thank these God. Are the, these thank are God the sto- I didn't know you back then. Yeah, well, we have two different worlds and now we're together. Mm-hmm. Mm. But these things make us who we are, right? We, we've all done. That's the whole point yeah. why we're telling these stories because people can relate. I'm, I'm sure. trying to think of a story. I was never like, oh, Bro. sorry. <laughs> sorry that I just cracked my knuckles. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I forgot how this. good these microphones are. <laughs> they pick up every single little thing. That was no, neither thing. of us farted. That was. <laughs> <laughs> that was Chloe cracking our knuckles. I had to crack yeah. my knuckles. Crack your knuckles. My knuckles. Yes, yes. I love when you say your knuckles. Crack your knuckles, my friend. Your knuckles. Yes. Um, oh, I feel like there's a story you've that told, I have. You, you've told me a few stories. Like, I remember you telling me how you, as a kid, you had like really nice curly hair. You want to tell people about that now? Frankie, that's just random. You don't want to talk about that? It's a childhood thing, is it? Yeah, but it's not that important. What about the bike accident? Like, oh, God. Do you want to talk about oh, yeah, that? Oh, yeah, so my dad, right. my parents got um, me and my sister motorbikes when we were little. I got a, uh, a peewee, like two, two-wheeler. two Peewee. And then Karina's, when Karina had her birthday, I yeah. can't remember what ages we were. I was quite young. Yeah. I had a peewee, two-wheeler, and then Karina got a quad bike. It was pink. It was like pink cargo pattern. Oh, nice. It was sick. So it was stylish. It was Very sick, stylish. Right? Mm. So I was riding it with her at the park. Yep. This is illegal, by the way. We just went for a quick little... Mm-hmm. Um, as you do quick, as kids. Quick little drive just yeah, across yeah, yeah. the road to the yeah. park and back home. Yeah. Um. So mind you, this day we had my cousin Joshua's confirmation. Yeah. So we had to go to church. Yep. I think it was at St. Patrick's Cathedral. This could be... No, no, no. I might be getting it mixed up. But anyway, we had to go to church yep. and then we had a dinner. Yeah. And mum had gone up to the ro- up the road to the deli to get stuff for lunch because we're going to have lunch and yep. then go to the confirmation, then go to the dinner. Yeah. So in that span of my mum leaving, mm-hmm. dad's like, yeah, we'll go quick, quick drive. Quick, 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 quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I took yeah. Karina on the front and I was behind her. Mm. So she was or other way around, she right? was smaller, so you're like Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And this bug landed on my arm. Mm. Obviously I'm older, so I was steering and and you know, controlling the accelerator. Yeah. I said, Don't move. <laughs> Don't move. Don't touch anything. <laughs> Don't move. There is a massive <laughs> bug on my arm. It looked like a moth. Like a moth, don't move. Caterpillar. I don't know what it was to this yeah, day. Yeah, I'd yeah, never yeah. seen it. So I freaked out. And yeah, I was like, yeah. don't press the accelerator, don't press anything. Yeah. I need to get this thing off me. Yeah. And as I've gone to shoot it off, she's hit the accelerator. Oh, shit. Full ball. Oh, shit. You know this story. No, no, no. But I didn't. Oh, I know, full, but full I didn't. Ball. Your context, you're explaining it. And I'm like, oh, shit. She it f- was that bad. She pressed the accelerator all the way down. The bike flew. Oh, um, um, like it went to. Through us and then over us. Lucky we had helmets on. Like the monster truck. It like, was, but- yeah. It was fucked. <laughs> so, mind you, keep in mind, we have a confirmation. The bike flew over us. The bike went flying, flying, yeah, flying. Karina is a you little shit. Come on, she come didn't on. Listen, so <laughs> come on. She's she almost fl- killed you guys. She's flinged off. I flung oh, off. What? The bike's gone. 
<gasps> You're I'm, lucky that bike didn't land on you guys. My cause... face fucked. I had a bloody nose, scratched eye, black eye. You know what this sounds Same like? Same with Karina. What? You know in the movies when before they start, you, it goes, you're probably wondering how I got here. Pretty much. Re, rewind. <laughs> that was literally it, you guys, right there and then. Yeah. So we were all scratched up, bloody nose. <gasps> My nose didn't stop bleeding for ages. <sighs> it was a whole situation. Collateral damage. And then we had to go to Collateral church. Collateral damage. We had to go to church. Look, or, looking like we both been bashed by our parents, which we hadn't. <laughs> all because Karina pressed the accelerator and didn't listen. Oh, God. It was fucked. Wow. Yep. It was bad. I knew it was bad. I didn't know it was bad to that extent. Yeah, no, and then we had to go to church looking the way we did. And act like Pitching everything was two normal. two little girls. I reckon I was 10 and she was, no, I reckon younger. Yeah, yeah. Maybe like seven. Oh, no. Eight and you guys were young, four, but you, you 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 were young. Eight, yeah, nine and five. I don't yeah. know. We there was like I was still older. Yeah, but she was a lot younger. Like she's two years nine months. Um, wow. Yeah, that could have ended up really tragic. Yeah, but thank God, thankfully, that's not the case. I know, but yeah, that that all happened, and we went straight home, and then yeah. it was a whole thing of like, oh my God, we have to go to church. We got to go to go confirmation. You're all scratched. You're all bruised. <laughs> you're bleeding. You're this. You're that. It was bad. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. We, we, were, know, we were little redheads. But, you, but the though, thing, we the thing is, kids. though, right, kids, If I feel like back then, because I can't really say now because it's all tech now, I feel like back then we were always out, we were oh, playing. Yeah, outside. So, of course, you're going to expect injuries and things like that to happen, but mm. they were fun. You got scratches, you got bruises. That, that stuff toughened you up. Yeah. You know what I mean? We it were made always, you a better. Always outside. Yeah. It if, made you a better kid, like yeah. stronger and tougher. Even for after it. school. Yeah. Like after school, we'd go straight to the park. I'd go to the park with the boys. Yeah, with um, the boys, yeah. Like just everyone in the area, we'd all yeah. go to the park. Yeah. We'd go for bike rides. Yeah. Um, then on the weekends, God bless my parents, yeah, they yeah. would take us to car shows. Yeah. Like my parents love 50s style music. So like we'd go to like, I think they're called the Straight Eights. Yeah. We went to a couple of their shows. They took us to di- like a, this dinner dance once at like this place called Double Deuces and it's all oh, 50s. Wow. So we all had to, we had to dress up 50s. It's, uh, it was a lot, a lot of the time it was so very themed. It was themed I like see that, why you get your 50 and 80s and 90 vibes and kind of thing yeah. like that. Yeah. Cause my you, parents, yeah. they brought us up with the music they listened yeah. to. Like, and now it's like our favorite music. You lo- now you love uh, Johnny Cash. You love Alvis. Oh, Johnny you Cash, love, Alvis, uh, UB40, yeah, Bob Marley. Yeah. I love 80s music. Yeah. yeah. 80s and not, no, 70s, 80s, 90s. Yeah. yeah. Um, but uh, I really do believe that childhood, regardless of good or bad, it shapes who you become as a kid, like not as a kid, as a as an adult. Oh, yeah, 100%. Oh, big time. 100%. And big now, time. Now, Dad, what do we listen to when we're driving? Music. We listen to the same thing. We always think about like things that happened when we were kids, mm, like reminiscing. Yeah, we, you know? we're we're gonna have so many episodes about yeah. our, our bring our what's it called our bringing up our bringing our bringing up bringing up our bringing bringing up Chloe and Frankie. There's <laughs> so many stories. Yeah, so yeah. many stories and things that we can talk yeah. about. Nah, it's um, it's. It's you think window down, reminiscing, cool breeze, chilling, listen to the music you used to listen to as a kid. I'm setting the scene now, right? The vibe. And you're like, yeah, I remember that time I got my ass whooped. <laughs> <laughs> I got my ass whooped a lot. Yeah. So <laughs> nah, but um But yeah, there's so much to talk yeah. about when it comes to childhood and oh. like nostalgic things. Things that are around. Like things that don't look the same anymore. Like a lot, you know the a, cinemas. Yeah. You know, the only cinema that I can think of that looks the same is at Sunshine, Sunshine Plaza. I went there and it looked we went there recently. freaking amazing. It's the same. It looks amazing. They've got the, the space theme still, like the yeah. stars on the carpet. It's yeah. all dark blue and yeah. pink and oh, red. Oh, wow. We went. Yeah, we I did. Went. You know, the it's first thing I, I noticed when I, if, you have, if you've gone there, the first thing you notice is the carpet. The carpet is the literally carpet is like, like confetti. Throwback. Space. It's throwback. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's literally, it's untouched. Yeah. They've left it and that's like the best. Good on them. It's the best cinema. Good on them because you know, a lot of the cinemas you go to now, you you just see the same thing all the time. It's There's, more lu- like they try and make a luxury. Yeah. And, and comfort and everything. Comfort, luxury. But, yes, the chairs are uncomfortable, yeah. but it's all the same. But when you walk in there, you get the vibe like, oh my God, I'm at a cinema. Like, I'm, I'm about to watch back, something. Yeah. Stepping back, back to the future. Back in time. Yeah. Back in time. Back to... Oh, yeah. 
Sorry, I thought about the movie Back to the Future. <laughs> but, yeah, it's like you're going back in time. Yeah. That's freaking it's awesome. It's untouched. It's great. Yeah. Well, I hope they never, like... I hope they leave yeah, it. Yeah, I hope they leave it. What's the word? It's like a... Um, Nostalgia. It's... it's What do they call it? It's like a... a, a, a like a monument? Like sentiment? Piece of history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's really good. Um, but yeah, to close up that segment, we did a Q&A on our story on Instagram. Yeah, um, we, yeah, we got the, the beautiful input people involved. We got you guys telling us, you know, um, oh. pretty much a little bit about your childhood and summing it up in Baby, what, come back. what was like three words. Sum up your childhood in, childhood in three words. Where is it? <clears throat> Bring it up. The people want to see. Bring it up, my friend. I hey. have to make sure the, hey. the song doesn't play because it'll be copyright. Why don't you just put your phone on mute? There you go. There. All right. All so right. we've got... Um, so, so what the was the qu- question? The question was sum up your childhood in three words. Mm-hmm. Um, so do you want do you want to tell us yours first? Do you have one? Yeah. Okay. I'll start with me because I was a... You little shit. Um, my childhood... You little shit. Exactly that. My childhood was eventful. <laughs> yes. <laughs> naughty. Very, very naughty. And lessons. Yes, a lot of lessons learned. So you didn't have fun? No, I had eventful. Like eventful eventful was fun. It was fun, but there was a lot of lessons I had to, (laughs) that I had to be learning, you know, as whooping ways. But it was fun, eventful lessons. And I'm going to, what was the other one that I said? It was not, it's not three words. I I said lessons. Lessons. Eventful, eventful. fun. And I can't I can't. Rem- I can't remember the other one, but I yeah. said three words. Oh, and I said, and I said three naughty. words. Yeah, but I'm saying four. Okay. I'm saying four. I'm saying four. Yes, four, four, four. Okay. Yes. What's that was, the fourth word? It was naughty because I was naughty. a very naughty boy. You naughty, mm. naughty boy. Yeah. Yeah. You this boy. Okay. Yes. Um, I'll say mine. Yeah, you want to go? Norbert. Norbert. <laughs> Respusha. Yeah. And Shrek. Shrek, movies. Yeah. You should add the burnt CD, man. The bird, yeah. Yeah, he, he, I, he hooked it up the for you. They were three things yeah, yeah. that kept my childhood so fun. Everything was a meme. Everything was yeah. funny. But if we want to take it seriously, yeah. I would say fun, yeah, memorable, yeah, and th- fun, fun, memorable, yeah, and eventful. Eventful. There was always something going down. Yeah, always something fun to do. Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, that's good. Um, but yeah, so nah. someone well, said out of control. Okay, I like yeah, that. I like that. That definitely sounds like a lot of people childhood. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, yeah. Grapes and dragonflies. Shout out to Alicia. Um, Who's that, Alicia? My cousin. Yes. So that was one of our. I, I call it meme movies. Yeah, yeah. Um, so that movie was Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Oh, there was the little senor- Yeah, the little senora, one of yeah. his nonnas in the bed. Yeah, yeah. She she goes, I like grapes. <laughs> and then one in one scene, she goes, I like grapes. Yeah. And are we talk? He- are we sorry? Are we talking about the um? What's his name? Charlie Bucket. No, no. What's um? The Johnny Depp one. The Johnny Depp yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. There's one scene where she goes. I like grapes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's one where she's sitting there and out yeah, of nowhere yeah. she goes, dragonfly. <laughs> <laughs> that was like our thing when we were kids. Yeah. I came across this meme on the internet, right, about that. Yeah. It goes, there ain't no way that Charlie Bucket was poor with his mum having mouth skills like that. Stop it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> You know the meme I'm talking about? Yes, I know the meme. <laughs> she's she's sucking on the chocolate. And like, yeah, like, ain't no way these guys are poor. Oh my God. <laughs> ain't no way. You know. told Mrs. Bucket nah. to go to the streets. Nah. <laughs> nah. You can't tell Mrs. Bucket to go to the streets. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing better than cabbage. Just too busy making cabbage soup. <laughs> Shit, <Sheer> well. <laughs> Frankie, that's inappropriate. Mrs. Mrs. Bucket has some special talents. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sorry, Someone's sorry. got to think for Mrs. Bucket. Hey, um, you got to think for Mrs. Bucket. I'm just saying, girl has some skills. Come on. All right, oh, let's move on. Let's move God. on to oh, the next question. Next um, question. Very fucking cool. Yes. I like that. Yes. Then there's fun but strict. Thanks, mum. Mm. Mm. That's mum. Mum giving out mom, some strict lessons. Exciting, this way. chaotic, and fun. Chaotic. Mm. That's the word. Chaos. Chaos always. Yes. 
Then we got crazy as fuck. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yes. That person yep. sounded like they had a really good time. They got up to some shenanigans, some, some, nah, shenanigans. Nah. Nah. Like the, like the, the meme board thing. No. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And then we've got this, this person has a few. So it's gold star chore stickers. Gold star? Oh, stickers. Is that Always. the gold star from primary school? So obviously school? she, she did her chores and got a sticker every time oh, she got. That's the best feeling. Yeah. That is the best feeling. Well worn, peeling apart school shoes. Well worn, like it's ruined. Yeah, and I, I rem- feel like every kid yeah. was like that. Like the soles, they or- had their shoes that they were imprinted and comfy, and you didn't want to change them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or there, there was like a favorite shoe. Yeah, and you just you never wanted to get rid of them, yeah. so you glue it back or something. Definitely. Yeah, and then the. Cuchayo. I'm pretty sure that's the spoon, the wooden spoon. Wooden spoon. Cuchayo. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Did, did they used to get you guys to do your hands like this? No, that's no? that's racist. No, like, <laughs> I'm joking. What? No, it's just a thing. No, Italians, you put your hands because with Europe- us. A lot of Europeans. Yeah. They speak with their hands. If you guys haven't realized, I'm always moving yeah, my yeah. hands. Yeah, no, but you're getting me wrong because yeah. with the wooden spoon. Africans, they tell you to put your hand like this. Yeah. And then they'll hit you with a wooden spoon. Like that on top of Yeah. The, that's bad. Yeah. That's, that would uh, hurt. Well, what was, did what you was, moisturize? Yes, I did. Your I'm hands slick, are nice. Slick and I'm silky smooth. Yes, silky it's smooth. Nice. Zohan, silky yeah. smooth. Hmm? Yes. Yes. Yeah, oh, no, I so thought you, it was... I thought for, it was, for everyone that's listening, you know that meme of the Italian hand and they put their fingers all together? Anyway, Sorry. that's what Frankie's doing, and they'd hit the spoon on the top of the fingertips. Yes. No, we'd get it on the ass, we'd get it on the Ooh. hand. We would get <laughs> on it the anyway. ass. Yeah. You clean your dirty ass. <laughs> dirty ass. <laughs> on the ass. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah, anywhere. Yeah. Okay. Anywhere. Okay. Um, but yeah, so that's that was the answers from yeah. that. Um it sounds very similar to some of the things we were talking about in yeah, our time. Yeah. Yeah. Well, like everyone that kind of answers are in our in our age range, yeah. I believe. They um, were all outside playing. That's the difference. None of this oh, tech yeah, stuff. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Adventurous outdoor kids. Do we have kids. another one? Should we do another uh, the other Q&A? About childhood memories or? Most memorable childhood moments. Let's do it, yeah. All right, so here's the first one. Yeah. This is from my darling sister because mm-hmm. this is involving me. Yes. Chasing Chloe around the house with a knife. See? That's did why you I said. Ever, did you ever do that? Did you no, ever chase? I didn't chase my siblings around with a knife. My sister but, uh, used to chase me with a knife. Psycho. And then psycho. She, I'd, claw, I'd lock myself in the door and yeah. then she'd get the knife and go <laughs> down the door with the knife and then she'd do it underneath the door. What? So like I wouldn't even stand next to Bro, the door. She psycho. Would, she'd go like this. She'd jump American it psycho. Under that, little, under that little gap under Karina, the door. Wh- wh- why? Why? Yeah. Do you remember that night I called you? Yeah. I had to ring Frankie oh, one night because she sma- she snapped a coat hanger in half <gasps> and she was chasing me oh, around with this goodness. coat hanger. And then Frankie came over. What was that? Mm, yeah. Suspense. Coat hanger knife. He, yeah. yeah. And then that was the night you came over and you read the Bible to us, remember? And then you tried <laughs> on one of my dresses. <laughs> that a- was a very eventful <laughs> evening. So then there's this one. Yeah. I once licked a girl in kindergarten because I thought she was made of chocolate. <laughs> nah. She was black. <laughs> Have a lick. <laughs> I. That reminds me of the Cadbury ad. Wouldn't it be nice if the world was dark? Yeah. Like, have you seen that? I've never licked Frankie. Should I try it? Let's okay. See. Does it taste? It tastes like moisturizer. Salty? Oh, salty chocolate. No chocolate in here. Um, yeah. Oh. When I shot a gun at nine years out and was exposed to the village lifestyle. Ooh, country boy. Country boy. Yeah. Was there horses included as well? I don't know. Oh. Hey, nine years old with a pum pum. Yeah. Oh, this <laughs> is from our, um, our friend um, Teresa. Yeah. Um, starfish on your arms and Karina vomiting blue later. Your yeah. mum thought it was the starfish. So funny story, we went um, to the rock pools with our McGrady's, our friends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and me and Karina came with them and yeah. Karina put starfishes all along her arms. Mm. And after that, we went to the Flinders, um, 
like fish and Sorry, chip I'm shop. Fixing this. Yeah, I'm oh, listening. Flinders Fish and Chip Shop, and they were famous for vanilla slice. Yeah, and we had vanilla slice and pop tops. Do you remember pop tops? Yeah, yeah, I remember them. Ka- they were really Karina good. Karina had yeah. a blue pop top. Oh. And ate vanilla slice. Oh, so she's oh, come okay. back to the beach house and she's thrown up <gasps> blue. And is it because she mixed them? Is it because she mixed? She had cake, the like cake a with the pop, cake with yeah. a blue pop. Oh, um, yeah, that's probably why. And then my mum yeah. thought it was the starfish that she had because she put starfish all over her arms. Oh, she thought it she went thought in. She thought she got poisoned. <gasps> But she ate. Yo, <laughs> she mixed her food. That's like, can, is that even a thing? Like for that to happen? I don't, or, I don't no. know. Well, I don't that's a good so, one. But... Thank you, Teresa. That's a great one. <laughs> um, and then I'm, I'm just saying the names because like I, I'm involved in half these things. Yeah, no, nah, all good. Um, Alicia said the Pinossi lighter. Pinossi. So funny story. We were, at, we were at my nana and nanu's place, and we were going through the cupboard in the state, like the stationary station in the study. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we've opened up. We've opened up a drawer. Yeah. The and, secret drawer. Yeah, yeah. We've opened up a drawer yeah. and we found a lighter. Mm, go on. Go on. Then, so go we, on. We're like, oh, my God, what's this lighter? We push it and a penis came out of the lighter. <laughs> the first time and you guys were introduced to the world. We, we could not stop laughing. And it, like you just go, Psh, and this dick would come out. Oh. And we were little, yeah. And that was just ingrained. So every yeah, time, yeah. every time we'd go to Nanda and Nanda's place, we'd Pinusi. look for the lighter. And then recently, we tried to look for it. It's, got, it's, it's gone. probably gone. Yeah. I reckon it was Damn. part of like a. You should. One of you guys should have taken it and just kept it because that's like sentimental to your um childhood. Okay. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Well, it's gone now. It's gone now. Yeah. Okay. And then going from Rye Carnival in Woolies shopping trolleys. I love that. What getting in the shopping trolley? Yeah, at Rye. Yeah. I've never done that, so that's, I can't really relate, really but that sweet, sounds fun. Like, that sounds fun, especially that's, during summer. Yeah, that sounds like something you'd see in Jack House. Yeah. Yeah. No, that sounds really and then fun. another one, um, beach holidays with my cousins, cousin holidays here. Did yeah. You, did you ever go away with your cousins? No, I actually didn't because my cousins, when they came here, they were a lot older. So, um, like, they came, yeah. they we experienced more primary school onto teenage years. Yep. Um, oh, so like now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like when we went away with um. Yeah, Ooh, June. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. So like now you did that stuff. Like yeah, as yeah. You're older. But but majority of the time they came after we came to Australia. Yeah. yeah. But well, I do enough. I do know what you mean. Mm. Um. But there was one thing I was not like I never really got to experience was sleepovers. My mum was a it was a big no no. Yeah, me like, either. Nah, you don't no. go to like regardless if we know the person or not. You don't sleep over yeah, at no. other people's homes. Well, your, is um, your house not good enough? Uh, is, no, your, is, like, your bed, is your bed not good enough no, here? No, no. Clearly not. <laughs> nah, that, that's, my bed that's was what very the, comfy. That's the conversation. Yeah, they will, they will say that's that. The conversation. Or, or, or what about when you go out, they tell you, before you go out, they'll be like, this place we're going, don't ask for nothing, don't eat nothing until we tell you to or you're, you've been told. Yeah. Was yeah. that a thing? Yeah. You better behave before we go to this place. You better be on your best behavior. Mm. Like, you know, yeah. Mm. But um, those those are we still going with the Q and A questions? I've or? got two more. Yeah, let's get, oh, let's no, get I've got it. One more. Let's get it. Yes, yes. My cousin underage in my mum's car. Cousin yep. Joe decided to drive us in the streets of Tukaruk. Underage. Underage. But back then you could Ooh. do so much. Yeah, but there's a lot out there as well. There, there were probably a lot more open like open spaces. I I don't know about back then, but from where we go now, it seems like there is a lot of open spaces where you can yeah. do, you know, back. Like yeah, backyard. but Tukaruk is very, yeah. um, you know. It's pretty chilled up there. Yeah, it's yeah, good. Very chilled. Yeah, yeah. And we have our first very large question time answer from um, a member of our community. Let's give it. Let's give him a shout out. Hello. Uh, Aeon. Thank you very much for this, my I friend. Said hello. Did you yes? Hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. You probably will do the intro so, again. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, I know. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this is from one of our people on Instagram. So when I was about five or six, my nonna bought me this cute little bunny to have as a pet. Aww. Or so I thought. Oh, this I love this good. bunny so much. I'd play with it every day and just loved having it as my pet. Oh, that's nice. Anyway, about a year goes by. Mm-hmm. Um. Oh. A, a, but anyway, about a year goes by. Yeah. Having this little bunny as our pet. Yeah. A year worth of memories. Yeah. Love and me growing an attachment to my yeah. pet. Yeah. One day my bunny is gone, never to be seen again. 
Oh. My parents told me he ran away. I was so distraught and sad. (laughs) Yeah, I was so distraught and sad that I didn't have my little bunny anymore and was so mad that he ran away. Come to find out about 10 years later... That these motherfuckers, <laughs> my family in, in in what's it called, in brackets, gave him to my zeal to cook and eat. And we only had him for that year to fatten him up. Just wog tings. Low key traumatized, but it's all good. Wog families are wild as fuck, oh. but they're the best. They're going to eat your rabbit. So, so <laughs> they're going to eat I your can, rabbit. I can tell you now, oh. I know so many people that that's happened they're to. They're cooked Peter Rabbit. Yeah. Oh, what? You know, well, especially like Italians, but the Maltese actually cook rabbit stew. Oh, that that that's, that does sound. Rabbit I soup. I can't talk. That does sound very Roast yum. Roast rabbit. Oh, that sounds I good. I know so many people that that's happened That sounds good. To. So this poor girl, but like she got the attachment to it. Oh. Imagine having a dog and then it's just gone. If you've got, she was attached to this oh, bunny. Ten years later, is what she found out. Years. It wasn't like a right, like a, a day or two afterwards, you know. But okay. they did it ten years. Like it was courteous. Like ten years later, after she ate it, and like she did, she eat it. I don't know. Oh, that we Look, need. To, we, sure. we should probably find out if she I ate I it. I don't want to ask that. That just oh, <laughs> it might be more traumatizing. That's very bad. Oh, but um, but yeah, that was our first oh. very big question time, and we're like, we really. Want to encourage that? Yes. So when we do our Q&As on our story, you're yeah. more than welcome to DM us your stories as well. 100%, guys. Please bring um, it in. We're, the juicier, the better. Yeah, and we're having fun with it, you know. It's a yeah. good opportunity for you guys to get your stories out Any there. Any story. But, it um, doesn't matter. Yeah, it does nah. not matter. It's unfiltered at the end of the yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, but it's... And look. also, people yeah. have realised, yeah. well, I'm sure they've realised, our videos are one take. Yeah, we don't... One take. We don't do retakes, none of this. We don't do chop change, nah, blah, blah, nah, we blah. Don't, we don't give a shit about that no. because we're just having a good time and it's, just it's genuine. Yeah, yeah, in the moment. But, yeah. but guys, keep sending them. I you know, know, please, thank you. We'll do please, another... Please, thank you. Yes, please and thank <laughs> please, you. Please, thank you. But we will do another one. Yes. Yeah, we'll do another one and, yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to get your story out there. I know, yeah. But yes. please, DM us big ones. If you've got big, juicy stories. We don't care. We'll, we'll put it out we'll there. We'll put it out there. If, well, if you want it yeah, out there. Yeah, obviously, if you want it out there respectfully. Yeah. Um, and, you know, names will always be confidential, right? Yes, yeah. Obviously, the people you know, different story. But Yeah, a couple of people. I'm like, no. Yeah, because we've had private conversations and they don't mind. Yeah. You know what I mean? But also, guys, quick break, okay? Quick into... Um, what? Well, Quick, quick break, all right? I'm just going to interrupt. It's like an advert. Okay, guys. If you're watching on YouTube, please make sure oh. to like and subscribe. Okay, guys? And leave a comment yes, as well. Yes, because it really does help us, um, you know, obviously to push this forward to get it to more people out there, um, more engagement. But we're loving the engagement as well. And if you're listening on Spotify... Please give us your feedbacks. And Let you us... can leave a review. Yes, and we we will be doing some polls on Spotify yeah, as well. There's yeah, there's po- polls and Q&As. Yes. You. I didn't know that was a thing. Me neither until, yeah. you know, we found yeah. out recently. But, um, yeah, guys, just, yeah... Like and, and you, subscribe. Also, yeah. if you want us to be posting on other platforms, let us know. Yeah. Uh, we're just doing Spotify and YouTube at the moment. At the moment. Um, yeah. it's they're definitely the two most popular. Yeah. So we've just stuck with at them the too. Moment, but yeah. if you if you know, if we get a large amount of people wanting that say on iTunes is it iTunes? Um Apple Apple Podcasts or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We or, can put I it don't in. know. Yeah, yeah. Please let us know when we're open to yeah, doing stuff. Just DM us, let's yeah. get conversations going, because at the end of the day. It's a community thing. Yes. It's not about us. This is yeah. bigger than the both of us. You know what I mean? We yeah. want to we want to get your stories that's out there. Right. We want to get more things out we there. We want to eventually have people come on. Yeah. Ultimately, that's our goal. That's have the goal. Have people to come on. And explore um, the conversations. We'll have a topic at hand and we'll just have the, that discussion with yes. people. But there's a um, lot of freedom here. This is a, let's get let's get it straight. It's freedom, but also safety, a, sa- a state, uh, I can't even talk, a safety net, you know, you you're free to express your opinions. Definitely. You're free to tell your story and just vibes as well. We're having a good time. We're just vibing, please. Yes. That's all it is. Okay. Ad break um, over. So yeah. <laughs> to close to close our episode up. Yes. I was like Tori from, from maths just from then. From maths. With the Tori heads. energy. So to wrap up this episode, mm. I'm coming in with um the segment that we all love. <laughs> what is it? What is it? 
What's in the bag? And look who's got an item in the bag I today. I have an item today. Yes, it's about time, yo. Yeah. Come so, on. Um, this my this is my bag. Yes. It's a temporary bag because we are in the midst of purchasing bags yes. and we're going to be customizing them. Our own bag. Yeah, so yes. I've just got my my trusty Enviro bag. Look at the cheat little the leopard le uh, leopard it's or so cheetah fitting, print. It's so fitting to my it's aesthetic. It's your aesthetic. It's definitely it's Chloe. So fitting to my aesthetic. Very much her. Look at that. So today, yes, what do I we know have? that this this item Look away. I don't know what it is. It's um it both pl it played a role in both of our childhoods. Yeah. Um so this is it's Michael. It's the Michael Jackson number one's yes. DVD. <laughs> with, um, it's the OG. See all the all the shit that's on show it. Show him, show him, show him up close. This is an OG disc. Yes, it is. Open it up. Open it up. It's Let's got see. the disc in it. So it's oh, literally. Yes. Oh my god, that's bringing back memories. I know. Good it's time. just all of the Michael Jackson so like his number one songs, and um, yeah. What's your favorite Michael Jackson song as a kid, like growing up, like? As a kid, I really liked um, The Way You Make Me Feel. Um, that's the song that made me fall in love with him. I thought this man is so hot. He's beautiful. He can sing. He can dance. Um, I was quite young, though, until I realised who he actually was. Hey, pretty baby. With fun, hey, fun on. fact. I have the same birthday as him. Look at that. Um, so. Sharing, the, sharing um, a birthday with yeah. the iconic king of pop. Yeah. I have a story, though. Yeah, go with on. this item. So I'll tell my story. Yeah. And you tell your story regarding okay, this. Cool. So I was at my friend Lizzie's house one day. I think it was her birthday. There was a heap of girls there. Yeah. And some, oh, I think it was me, said her birthday is very close to mine yeah, as yeah. well. My Virgo friendy. Hi, Lizzie. Peace out. Um, we go, who wants to watch Thriller? Oh, the music who video? Who wants to watch Thriller? Mind you, before this, I was at my cut, like, Prior to this, I was at my cousin Alicia's house and we put it on and it was bad because we were all crying and screaming. Yeah. Um, and the same thing pretty much happened at Lizzie's house. We were all <sighs> screaming because yeah. it was scary. That's, it's still a scary music video to I, this day. I still can't adult. watch it. Yeah. To this day, I still can't watch the music yeah. video. Um, yuck, babe, stop. <laughs> um, <laughs> Spinning fingers. Yeah, so that's my story with it. Yeah. Thriller. Thriller was obviously a great song. Yeah. Traumatizing. Yeah. But the music video, you can't stand. Traumatizing that reminds, video clip. That's why then, because I remember one time I put Thriller on the TV to watch the music um, the music video on yeah. YouTube. And you're like, oh my God, turn it off, turn it off. I and can't, like, I can't watch it. Like this is, this is iconic, you know? It's, it is iconic. <clears throat> but every time we watched it, <clears throat> I would. Sorry, I'm doing the dance. Every time I watched it, there was either screaming or crying. And then when he died, oh, my God. Oh, yeah. You were going to go to his I, concert, My mum was like, no matter how much the tickets are, she's going to take me because yeah. I love that that man yeah. with all my heart. Yeah. And then when we when I was old enough to understand that we had the same birthday, the oh, obsession. It made it, it made it even worse. The obsession went yeah. psychotic. Like, it was not normal. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, Michael Jackson number ones. Yes. This is an iconic... DVD, disc. yeah. In the 2000s, every person I knew had this. I had this as well. So, Frankie, you this, take it away now. I don't really have a backstory is this with a good, Is this a good item, though? This is such a great item because I had this in my house as well. Oh, my God. I there had this. Go. It had all I the... knew, I knew. You mentioned it once before. That's yeah. why I thought it's going to be a good but item. You know how I, why I mentioned it? Because I was in your, your house one time and I saw it. I was like, hey, hang on a minute. I had this growing up as well. Yeah. This is like, you know, it has all his um, music videos and things. Ones. Yeah, this is childhood memories for me. Yeah. I don't have like a... Specific, obviously, story like yours because, you know, the, yours is a bit traumatic. But I just remember sitting and watching this with my with my mum, my sisters as well. Yeah. Um, and just, you know, this is where I saw the black and white video, all his everything. different, everything. All this, the iconic songs. Yes. Because on here he's got Don't Stop Till You Get Enough, all his, like, most well-known well, hits. Fun, huh? You know, it's Rock with you, Billy yeah, Jean. Yeah. Through a lot of bad. We have to feel Man yeah. in the Mirror. Smith I Criminal. love Man. I love Man in yeah. the Mirror. Dirty I'm, Diana, Black or White. I'm you were not alone. The Earth Song, Blood I'm, on the Dance Floor, and You Rock My World. Yeah, that was a good one. You rock my world. That's the one with. Um, he was very Is correct. it Chris Tucker? Chris Tucker. Jamali. 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 That's, that's, um, <laughs> that's Smokey from Friday. Yes. I know you don't smoke weed. I know this. But I'm going to get you high today because it's Friday. You ain't got no job. You ain't got no, shit to do. Is that the, you ain't got no job. You got you no car. 
Yeah, it's from Friday. Oh, Friday that's the movie. It. That's where it comes from. That's Chris Tucker saying that to Ice Cube, who plays oh, Craig. I love Ice Cube. We, we need to watch that. Yeah. And now that's a good throwback. Go watch it. Yeah. Friday. Yes. So do you have a story for this? No. The, my story is that I grew up listening oh, to this. Oh, you watched it and yes, listened. Yes. And I can't forget it because that's how good it was. And when I saw you, I saw this at your house, it brought back memories of childhood. Yeah. Like, yeah, since, you know, it's, it's befitting. This is a really good item. Thank this you. Is so really my first, good. my first, what's in the bag item is good. It's it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Great. It's really oh, good. Oh, good. Okay. Well, that's made me very confident for the yes. upcoming ones. Yes. Yes. Great. Yes. But um, oh, R.I.P. to the King of Pop. I know. Yeah. Um. So that's that's yeah. That's that concludes pretty much our episode, everyone. Great. What's in the bag item? Thank you, sir. Some good reflections on um, you know. Hey, right, I'm gonna put it back in the bag. Yes, yes. These right. these stories and moments. These are the things that shape and make us in our lives. That's um, it, mate. Yeah. Mate. Yeah, yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. Anyway, yes. that's the end of our episode. What's today's takeaway? Do we have three words to take away from today? I don't think it's three words, but the can last I... episode, I think I yeah. had a. You had you had boom boom boom. Yeah, you but go I've, it. You do I've, the boom I've boom got, boom okay. today. So for me today, the stories we've told, these are the stories and moments that shape and make who we are, regardless if they're good, they're bad. Early childhood development plays a huge part in everyone's life, regardless if you want to talk about it or not. You know, some of the shit like me getting my ass whooped, PTSD, but I learned lessons. I learned lessons from it. You know, some of your stories we clearly remember it because there's values and really good takeaways and lessons, mm -hmm. life lessons to learn from it. So, all I'm gonna say is that if there's one thing you're gonna you're gonna take away from today is be proud of your childhood, regardless if it was good or bad. It makes us who we are and embrace that shit. And, That's it. Yeah. And enjoy every single moment of That's life, right. you know? See? Spread the love. Spread the love. Spread the love. All love, no hate. Yes, that's right. I all said love. that in a previous episode. And we're going to say all, it again. All, all love, love, no hate. Yes. Love oh, my heart. God. We're going to put that on a T-shirt one day. All love, no, no hate. hate. Anyway. Yes. She's, Thank look you at for her, listening. Look at her. She's coming up with the merch ideas, merch right? Ideas. <laughs> hey, future, future. Hey, future, yeah. That's but it. look, hey, hey, everyone's witnessing That's the, it. you know. That's right. Yeah. But anyway, we hope you enjoyed this episode. Thank you guys um, so much. We hope uh, you join us again soon. Yes. And guys, let's keep communicating on That's socials it. as well, yeah? Get Follow engaged. Follow us, like, subscribe, all the shebang. Yes. Make sure to subscribe. Your boy needs... What? Subscription. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Your boy needs the love. Nah, no, but yeah. make sure to subscribe, guys. And um, yeah. Thank leave, you leave so a, much. Leave a comment in the comment section, good or bad. We appreciate it and we love you guys. Thank you so much. You. See you in the next video. Off oh, video. Next episode. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bye, See you guys. Everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. Take care. See ya. Ha 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 ha! Alright. Oh! Excellent.